Hi, in this video, you will learn the type of radiation filters and its process to isolate radiation wavelength for absorption measurement in UV and visible spectroscopy. Radiation filters operate by blocking or absorbing all but a restricted band of radiation. It is further classified as interference filters and absorption filters. Interference filters are typically used for absorption measurements in ultraviolet and visible radiation. As the name implies, an interference filter relies on optical interference, that is constructive and destructive interferences, to provide a relatively narrow band of radiation, typically 5 to 20 nanometer in width. It consists of a very thin layer of a transparent dielectric material coated on both sides with a film of metal that is thin enough to transmit approximately half of the radiation striking it and to reflect the other half. A dielectric is a non-conducting substance or insulator. Such materials are usually optically transparent. This area is sandwiched between two glass plates that protect it from the atmosphere. When radiation strikes the first metallic layer, approximately half radiation is transmitted by the first layer and the other half reflected. The transmitted radiation undergoes a similar partition when it reaches the second layer of metal. If the reflected portion from the second layer is of the proper wavelength, it is partially reflected from the inner portion of the first layer in phase with the incoming light of the same wavelength. The result is constructive interference of the radiation of this wavelength and destructive removal of most other wavelengths. Interference filters are more expensive than absorption filters but have narrower effective bandwidth typically 10 to 20 nanometer with maximum throughput of at least 40 percent absorption filter absorption filter absorbs light of certain wavelength and only allow radiation of a particular wavelength to pass through it. This type of filter is generally less expensive and more rugged than interference filters and limited in use to the visible region. This type of filter usually consists of a colored glass plate that absorbs part of the incident radiation and transmits the desired band of wavelengths. The light allows to pass depends on the material color. For example, a green filter allows the radiation in green region to pass through it and so on. Commercially available absorption filters provide effective bandwidth from 30 to 250 nanometer, which is wider than interference filter. The maximum throughput for the smallest effective bandwidth, however, may be only 10% of the source emission intensity over that range of wavelengths. Thus, absorption filter has low selectivity and the transmitted light has less monochromaticity. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.